Hey guys, today we're going to be taking a look at Flockers. Now, the thing that r really made me, well, flock to this game, eh, get it? <laughs> okay, the thing that really made me flock to this game is that it was made by Team 17. And Team 17 is pretty well known for making the Worm series, you know, that competitive worm game where you're sort of strategizing your moves and killing your friends. Uh, they made that game, and this game looked pretty cool. So, you know, I picked it up, and it's been pretty awesome so far. It is an early access, so it's not completely finished before you go and pick it up. But it is in the link in the description, so go, please, check it out in the link in the description and see if you might enjoy it. Sort of reminds me of Lemmings, but it's pretty cool overall. And before we hop into it, I do want to point out something. That if you go into the options, there's actually a Twitch streaming option. Where you can just sort of type in your username and password to your Twitch, press F5, and you're streaming on Twitch. I don't know how it works exactly, because I haven't... Uh, tried it, and I don't think I will because I'd rather use my own streaming programs. But it's a pretty cool thing to see, you know, sort of seeing how the gaming community is situating themselves to online entertainment like that. It's pretty cool. But, um, we're gonna do an early level, but there are three different areas, and it lets you have 20 different levels each area. And that's pretty cool. Uh, so we're just going to do a very, very early level, the second level, actually. And let's hop in. Now, it might seem like a nice, funny, friendly game, but trust me, it's very gruesome. Because while we have to guide these sheep that are coming out of this horn, um, we have to guide them to the end, which is way over here. And what we then have to do is find out how to get there, them there. And it's basically a bit of a puzzler. It's You have to be very quick, too, though. And you have to figure out how to get them there, killing as little as possible. But, of course, we have things like a gigantic evil buzzsaw blade stopping us so let me uh continue it and let's see what happens we can speed it up a bit if they're going a bit too slow and we have them pass this little checkpoint area and that'll affect things in a map like these blocks lowering and we got those two boxes you'll see these green and blue boxes and now just unlock different moves and we unlock this one block move which allows the sheep to go into a bit of a formation to assist the other sheep it's sort of like an i scratch your back you scratch mine situation where uh He's just there to help out the rest of the pack, and then I can release him once he's done his duties. And we're just going to keep doing that, make uh, stepping stones out of our sheep so that we can guide the other ones. They work as a pack and help each other out when they need it. Okay, where are they going to go now? They're going to lower this big one. And that's going to fall all the way down. Will they be okay? Yes, they will. Okay, and then they'll just lead over here. And this is where things get a little difficult. It's hard to react fast, because it's like... I can pause this and try to figure out what's going to happen and what I can do, but some things are unpredictable. And not only that, but I can't place things down to one I'm in pause mode. So once I figure out what I want to do, I have to be very quick with executing it. And personally, that's very difficult for me. We also have a timer, so we can't take forever. So let's speed these guys up a little bit now. And now they're making their way over here. And before I make them fall down, I do want one of them to get this golden sheep. And I'm not entirely sure what this sheep does. I just know that it's a cool little thing you find from level to level. I think it's just sort of like a bonus collectible. And I know, how, I figured out how to do this one. It's pretty simple. You just want to want one, one or two sheep by before you make a blocking wall and that'll block all these sheep. And they're gonna teleport over there. And now I just want to uh, get this jumping move from the purple box and make him jump and land right on that sheep. And that'll help somehow. Okay, and then I want to speed this up so that all the sheep are on there, and that'll lower it because the weight of the sheep is bringing this block down. So there is some physics to it, there's some, you know, actual problem-solving ideals to it. But then we release these two sheep and let them go, get sucked up, and the level is complete. And, you know, this one was pretty simple, they do get really complicated. To be honest, I'm very, very bad at the game. Um, I, like I said, I'm really bad at solving a puzzle but then having to execute it perfectly and quickly so that sheep don't do any issues is very difficult for me. I have a hard time doing that kind of stuff. And this one, obviously, quite a bit more complex. Uh, I don't think I've actually gotten around to solving this one, but, uh, like, you can skip ahead, you don't have to do all the levels in order, and this one I had a pretty hard time with, so let's see if we can't do it this time, though. I'll do it for you guys. Hitting it up for my subscribers. <laughs> okay, so... What do we want to do here? We want to build quickly. There we go. Okay, that should be enough. Alright. Ooh, so close. But of course, the death animation for these guys are very, very gruesome. It's like, literally, they explode in blood, and it's like, oh my gosh. It's a little, 
I don't know, unexpected, I guess. So, this is fine. I can release these guys. I can also release... who else? Is that it? I can release that guy, too. So I can release you and you. Okay. Oh, gosh. What is this happening here? Oh, no. No. Do this. See? That's a, this is where I have a problem. I just I can't execute all these things at once. It's very, very difficult for me. But there we go. Now we can release these guys. And they are going to get teleported where? I think up here. Yep, here they are. And now they are going to explode. Don't do it. Don't do it. No. Oof. Okay, a few of them got by, though, and I need these guys to stop. I need these guys to stop. See, it's like, why why won't it let me let them stop? No, stop. Stop. Ugh. I hate it. No. Like, it's not letting me place a doubt. Okay, then. Great game. Okay, now we have a red one. Now, we do have this purple one. This is the jumper move that I showed earlier in the last level, and I can press this. I can give these guys all the jumping moves, because they're going to need it. I'm going to jump over here, and then give them all this. And there's this one that's slightly ahead, and that's actually good, because I want him to blow up, because there's this block right here, and what's going to happen is he's going to blow up. There we go. And that's going to take out that block. If not, I would have zoomed right up into the spikes, and that wouldn't have been a pretty sight. I can guarantee you that. That happened to me last time. I was like, what do I do? All right, and they're going to fall. Now, I don't think they die because they are super. They're superheroes. So I want to superhero these guys up, though. So they, they don't die from fall damage either. Okay, now this is where I've had a hard time. Because it won't let me stop them. So I'm still trying to figure out what do I do here. Because obviously, this isn't working. And it just, I don't understand <laughs> at all. Okay then, I don't know. I think I'm going to throw in the towel. I'm a little confused here, because here it just says, oh, just put three down, and I've definitely put three down. I've put it here the last time I played, and it didn't seem to help at all. Anyways, this has been Flockers. I think you guys get a general idea. It's sort of like Lemmings with a twist. I'd like to thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a like, maybe share it with your friends, or even comment what you think about it. And there's that golden sheep. Okay, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.